Hi everybody, and welcome to How to Close a TV Deal or Die Trying. I believe we're on day 30, I think. Anyway, it says so. Do you mind if I sit next to your feet? Wow. Um, yes, and by the way, speaking of my feet and Nancy, I'm John Lear, your oh. host, Nancy behind the camera. Got a lot of responses, wow. uh, both publicly on Facebook and some even private, yeah. uh, about the toe. Nancy, for those of you who didn't see it, Nancy operated on my toe yesterday trying to remove what she thought was a uh, splinter. How does it feel? Pretty good. Yeah, <laughs> All right. And she put some ointment, not ointment, but... Um, put, uh, not potassium. Uh, iodine? No. no. Anyway, she put something on the toe that made it glisten. Mm -hmm. And I think, first of all, I think people have a problem with toes. Some people have a real, real fucking problem with toes. Other people, and no people have a problem with operating on anything. Like, if you've seen that yeah. reality show on the health It's funny network. that they wanted something sharp rather than dull, because frankly, I would want to see something dull. All I was doing was pushing at it. Well, Lightly. you obviously don't have a problem with toes. And no. as it was my toe, I didn't have like a problem Do you like having your toes sucked? Sucked? Mm -hmm. No, I'm not a foot person. Has anyone ever sucked your toes? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty gonna sure. say there's a no because really, I've done some pretty. I've, I've been you've across done the them. Board. I know, but I have you had somebody actually suck my toes? I don't know. I had a girl play head a gobbler and make sex <laughs> have sex with me as head a gobbler. That is so crazy. <laughs> it was wild. Was she in a play? Yeah, she was an actor. We have to censor all of this. This is crazy. Um, okay, so as far as a report on our deal, guess what, everybody? No real movement. Uh, we are expecting something any moment. Woo! Uh, but nothing nothing yet. I, uh, today, just came back from a general meeting at the Sci-Fi Network, mm -hmm. uh, which was very nice. I'm a big science fiction fan. Sci-Fi, by the way... Uh, is not about science fiction anymore. They're bigger than science. I don't quite... Un they're, they're, they they're, think... Imagine, imagine greater. greater. Imagine mm -hmm. greater. So, imagine greater than science fiction. Uh, I am, you know, I can imagine greater, but I am also a classic science fiction yeah. guy. Let's imagine science fiction, I love science fiction. Amazing. I, yeah. I am unabashedly... As do I. As do I. And Nancy, too. I think the two of us would be happiest... It, like, it, if you said, what would be your dream job? It would be, like, someone transported us to write for Battlestar Galactica. Oh, like, if we funny, could be... But be funny. Well, then it wouldn't be Battlestar yeah. Galactica. Well, I would love... Anyway, uh, so it was a very nice meeting. Uh, they were running late, so I waited for 20 minutes. But that's okay. That's not a lot. That's okay. My, what's your limit at a meeting? Can you... Like, can what would you... One hour. What? This... No, keep the light on your face. Oh. It was helping. Uh, um, one my, hour? One hour and I'm gone. Yeah. But, I, I mean, for the bitter end of that hour. And yeah. weirdly, most times when I have had to wait the longest... I've had the ones best ones. Yes, yeah. that's true. I don't know why. And my meeting went really well. Maybe because you're fueled by so much anger. You walk in like, I'm going to Well, you have you. something on them. Yeah. You're coming from a place of strength now mm -hmm. because they feel bad for making you wait. Although sometimes, sometimes they don't really. I had an audition once when I was an actor for Matthew Broderick. And I thought, he's an actor. He's going to be really cool. He picked up the phone <laughs> and started talking on it. Oh, during your audition? Yeah. Matthew Broderick, fuck <laughs> you. For doing that. And then, like, I saw him, like, three weeks later for dinner. He didn't even know who I was. I was like, wow. That wow. must have been a bad audition. You know, he killed somebody in Ireland with his car. Yeah. Never did any time for it. Ran somebody over, I think. You know, happens. Oh, have you killed somebody <laughs> with your car? No. Okay. All right. Uh, well, that's... But it may be the preferred way that I might take you out. Fine. It's quick. Just run me over Not the car. really. I mean, just make sure you do it. Well, Keep going if I back run you forth. over the car, you'll be like, boom, 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 you know, and you're. Be... Do it. Okay. Do we've, it. We've just get going far. fast. Don't do it slowly. So don't do it back in the back. Yeah. Come well, at me at like 50 miles an hour so it's just splat. That's that's a good way to go. <laughs> Ew. That's the worst way to I go. I like it because I would never know it. I would never see it coming. I <laughs> yes, you would. You'd see me flying at you at you 60 miles behind. an hour. Well, I have my iPod. How am I going to design that? Just, that's not my problem, Nancy. <sighs> Bye, right. everybody. Bye.